Hello and welcome to Continental Desi Kitchen. Today I am going to share with you another interesting vegan recipe which is Soya Kima Dry Fry. It's a very simple and quick recipe. So let's start with the recipe. So here you can see these are soya chunks. I have soaked in water for 15 minutes and I have added 1 tablespoon of salt. So now I am going to grind this in a mixer grinder. Drain off the excess water and then add in the grinder. So here you can see this is the soya kima and now we will start with the cooking process. So heat the pan at Add some vegetable oil. So I have added here 5 tablespoon of refined oil. Now add some cumin seeds. Add chopped onions. Add 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. I will be adding now some chopped tomatoes, some peas, some finely chopped capsicum. Saute them well on medium heat. We'll add the spices now, some salt. Turmeric powder, teaspoon of red chili powder, this is Kashmir red chili powder, cumin seed powder, coriander powder. Now give everything a good mix. Cover with a lid and let cook for 1 to 2 minutes on low to medium flame. Now I will be adding the soya kima. Mix everything well. I'll be now adding one teaspoon of Kitchen King Masala and half teaspoon of black pepper powder. To add spiciness in the dish, I'm now going to add Maggie hot and sweet chili sauce around two teaspoons. Now mix them well. Uh, if you don't have Kitchen King, you can add Maggi Masala Magic. So it will give a very good flavor to the dish. At last I am going to add my homemade Garam Masala Powder. Just half a teaspoon. That's it. My soya kima dry fry is ready to be served now. So friends, here is my soya kima dry fry. I have garnished with coriander leaves and white part of spring onions. So do try this quick and easy recipe. It goes really well with roti, chapati or naan. So if you have liked my today's video, Please do like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel for more such interesting videos. Until then, bye bye and take care.